What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back here to yet another awesome fishing video. Today, I'm going to be bringing you guys kind of like my first look and unboxing, kind of whatever you want to call it, style of video for the brand new Guggen Baits. That is right. I went to uh, the world famous Academy Sports and Outdoors. Uh, I believe it was. It, was, it might have been yesterday. It might have been yesterday, and I was just kind of walking through. I was on my way home, and I was just kind of walking through, and I wanted to see if they had any more Bandito bugs, because I really like those in one specific color, the June bug color, because I use that a lot, because most of my water is, uh, is pretty muddy. Um, but then also to see if they had the new baits. And these baits, they're even on guggenbaits.com they're sold out i don't know if they're sold out on mystery tackle box or carl's baits and tackle whatever it is um i don't know if they're sold out on there but they are sold out they sold out within like 15 or 20 minutes on the guggenbaits website so it's crazy that uh academy and my academy had them so uh so i'm going to kind of go quickly what i got just kind of i'm going to kind of open them up i have only opened up the Rattlin Ned, uh, the little Ned rig bait, which I believe is going to be like, it looks really good. It's great color. Uh, I've, I've felt it just a little bit, and I believe it's going to work like beautiful uh, in some of the creeks that you guys have seen me fish. I then uh, got the uh, the little Lunker Log, and this is the other one that I have uh pulled out and felt just briefly I haven't done too much with it and then also we have the uh, the six inch lunker log but I'm gonna kind of go into these kind of give you guys like my first opinion sorry if my dog is barking in the background give you guys my first opinion we're just gonna kind of go over it you guys are gonna get a, a blank review first thought right out of the bag um, like I said I haven't touched these too much so you guys are going to get hopefully a good opinion. So, um, other than that, if you guys haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe right down here. It's free. Do it to it. Lemon peasy, uh, as Lunkers TV says. Other than that, we are going to get into these baits and uh, yes. Alrighty, guys. So I just kind of, I've still got my camera right here. I, I, I just kind of like put it up on this little table right here. So, okay. So first of all, we are going to hop into the the rattling Ned right here. This is uh, the Guggen baits. Uh, Ned Rig style bait that they just came out with. If you guys didn't know, Guggen Baits, they just released these baits. I believe like you guys are seeing this video a little bit later, a couple days, a day or two later than when I am filming this right now, but currently I believe they po they released these baits like seven to ten days ago. So they, have, they haven't been out for long at all. Um, and so I got these uh, in the Green Pumpkin Gobi color and it looks really really good um and then you guys can can see like a little a little picture of it right there it's got like you can see the little ned rig right there but it looks really cool it comes in a pack of eight and it is 5.99 so uh and all these combined i believe is like 19 dollars uh, just over 20 just under 20 dollars i believe so um other than that I'm, i might show you guys some close-ups right here uh, but that, that is, let's see if I can kind of hold it out right there. That is the bait. Oops, I dropped it. That is the bait right there. I mean, it looks really cool. If you guys can tell, it's got a, it's kind of got some of the, some of the same ridges that you guys can find in the, uh, the dragon drop as well as the slim shake worm. Um, and then actually down here, you guys can, I don't know if you guys can, I might have to have to take my microphone off or take my little the little wind cover right here so you guys I don't know if you guys can hear that right there uh, but that is the rattle in here and it's it's like it's super cool that and unique that they put a, a little rattle in there uh, because when that thing is going going on the bottom it's just kind of sitting there rattling along and I don't, I don't know. I've, I've never obviously put a rattle in one of these, so um, I'm hoping it does make a, a big difference within uh, the its fish catching capabilities. Um, but uh, other than that, it was like it, it looks like a really cool bait. It's got a great color design, um, and I kind of. I kind of tried to get a natural color as well because I'm gonna I'm hope, hoping to be fishing in these in uh, one of my ponds uh, and it's normally very clear or pretty clear 
fairly clear. Uh, so these will work good, but also uh, some creeks. So hopefully I'll be able to go down and do some creek fishing with uh, some of these baits even. Maybe I might be able to take the, the lunker log, the five inch version down there and do some creek fishing with some Guggen baits. So um, other than that, I'm gonna hop in to the, uh, the lunker log right here. This is the Cinco style bait. Uh, I got it, it's, this is the five inch version and then we also have the six inch version that we'll get into in just a second. But it comes in an eight pack, five inches and it's, I got it in green pumpkin blue. So um, also a very, a very good uh, natural looking color. Uh, a lot of my, I, I believe, I don't, I don't know if I looked really too hard into the colors on these, these, uh, the lunker logs, but, uh, I think the, most of the colors around at my academy were, were pretty natural because we've got some fairly clear water here, but, uh, so it, it looks like a standard kind of five inch Cinco right there. I will be doing a, uh, probably either a Gary Yamamoto uh, verse Guggenbait Cinco or a Guggenbait Cinco verse uh, the Yum Dinger video. I will be doing one of those videos coming up here very soon, hopefully next week uh, or tomorrow morning or whatever. I don't know. I don't know. I will definitely be coming out with a, a Guggenbaits verse, probably Yum Dinger uh, Cinco challenge coming up here very soon. But again, a very, a very good looking color right there it's actually got it's actually fairly it's it's pretty it's pretty like wobbly you guys can tell here I'm not putting too much uh, uh, like movement on it I'm not trying to and it's it still gives off some good action you guys won't be able to tell but uh, right here in the middle it says uh, Guggen yeah, you guys definitely won't be able to tell that, but it's a standard Cinco. Um, I'm sure it, we'll, we'll have to maybe look at doing some like underwater testing and stuff like that, and then stay tuned for that, uh, the Guggen Baits vs. Yum Dinger Cinco Challenge. But um, it looks like a really good Cinco. I mean, a Cinco is a Cinco. It's a stick bait, uh, eight pack right here. And also, all these baits are in the, uh, in the hard casing. So, um, yeah, one thing that I would 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 be kind of cool of Guggenbaits to do is take the rattlin Ned and kind of mix it with the Cinco. Put a put a rattle in a Cinco. I wonder. I don't know if anybody's ever done that. Uh, any kind of small company or whatever, but that would be kind of interesting to put a rattle in a uh, a Ned rig. So, uh, and I would I would I'd buy some of those too. So, um, other than that, this video is getting just a hair long. Uh, we're only probably about like seven, seven, eight minutes. But next we have the Guggenbaits Lunker Log six inch version. So uh, this is uh, the six inch version, black blue flake. Did it? Okay, yeah, black blue flake. So just black and blue. Um, and this is in a six pack. So when they uh, when they're six inches, you get six. So um, yeah, but these look, these are looking pretty sweet. Uh, this is I've never I don't ever think I've thrown a six inch cinco, even like a Yum Dinger or a Gary Yamamoto one. Uh, I don't believe I've ever thrown a six inch cinco. So this will be a fun one to throw. Um, it's definitely a big bait and is gonna hopefully have lots of action. Um, and just by doing it right here, it's got it's got a very good amount of uh, flappiness. Um, I guess you could say uh, it's it's very similar to the same amount of flappiness and I'm just gonna say flappiness uh, as the the five inch version um, and you would think sometimes with a, a six inch Cinco it might get a little bit of stiff just because there is so much plastic um, but this one it, it feels very it feels really good and it, this bait is actually it's I don't know if dense is the right word but it feels fairly uh, like kind of heavy, I guess you could say. Um, so you'll definitely be able to cast this uh, pretty far with a uh, with a, a decent sized bait caster. Like I could probably get this pretty pretty far out there with uh, my seven foot medium heavy. So um, so that's one thing I like because I, I, I use bait casters a lot. So uh, being able to cast this guy out 
um, and you can throw this in some heavier stuff because you can throw it on a bait caster you can throw it in some heavier stuff and some pads and look for those big bass but that is kind of like my first take right there um, it look it looks like a really cool looking Senko um, they've they've all got these little uh, the little ridges right there uh, I don't know if you guys can tell that but um, yeah so that's kind of like let me get pop this sucker back in there that is kind of like my first take on some on the new Guggen baits um, I'm hoping they're gonna be dropping some more soon um, I know they are planning on coming out with like some swim baits so I'll definitely be picking some of those up um, but so far I have tried every Guggen bait that they make um, I've got the bandita bug crack and crawl trench hog drag and drop slim shake mondo worm Rattling Ned, 5 inch Lunker Log, and 6 inch lung, lunker, lunk, little, little, Lunker Log. So, um, other than that, definitely stay tuned for some videos on these. Um, and like I said, with the Lunker Logs, I'm going to try to do a, uh, a challenge like Guggen Baits versus Yum Dinger. So, um, so, stay tuned for that video, and uh, I will try to get it up here in the next uh, week or so. So, other than that, stay tuned. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you guys on the next episode of LMB Nation. Peace, guys.